It's great, you know, and, it, and obviously everyone's a, a, a professional and, you know, have been at this for several years now and know their, their roles really well and kind of knows who they are. So it, it is fun to, to sort of be the bigger group now and, and, and figure out how we work together as a team with these new elements that are in there now, you know. Uh, and, and how we're going to go forward to uh, take on this new crazy, uh, you know, baddie, Ultron. And I think it puts Rhodey in a tricky spot, like he always is, trying to, you know, bridge this relationship that he has between his service to the military and, and being a good friend in service to his friend and also now larger in service to this team that's, you know, all of their interests should be aligned, but they, aren't, they don't get to the goal in the same way. So I think that's what Rhodey is always trying to navigate. How do I stay, you know, within the confines of, you know, my, my, my military uh, ranking and, and do what I'm supposed to do, chain of command there, but also be a part of this team. James is great. He's uh, obviously been doing a long time and he's a really interesting actor. So I thought it was an interesting casting choice and I'm looking forward to see what he, what he brings ultimately. The best thing about Joss when you take on subject matter like this that could really come off stilted is that he has a really good sense of humor and that these characters are constantly sort of undercutting uh, the seriousness of world domination, <laughs> you know? They, 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 you know, poke at each other and they make fun of themselves and they laugh at each other. And I think that's, that's a good balance to have so that the movie doesn't take itself too seriously. We, we know that we're inside of a comic book paradigm. And that's very much in fitting with the, how comic books are too, you know, that very wry sense of humor. And Joss understands that and has that and has infused all the characters with that. Hey Lisa here with More on the Avengers. To help hide Scarlett Johansson's pregnancy during filming, three stunt doubles were hired. This caused a lot of confusion among other actors since, according to them, all the stunt women looked very similar to Johansson. Chris Evans stated that it got to one point where he would say hello and start a conversation with one of them, only to realise midway through the person he was talking to wasn't Johansson. That's all I've got for you today. Subscribe to keep up to date.